Welcome to our action-packed recap of the standalone, fast and furious film, Hobbs and Shaw. Our story kicks off in London, England, where MI6 agent Hattie Shaw, Vanessa Kirby, and her team raid a warehouse to secure a deadly virus known as the Snowflake. Things go south quickly when the super-enhanced Brixton lore, Idris Elba, appears, effortlessly taking down the agents with his cybernetic powers. To save the mission, Hattie injects herself with the virus and escapes, only for Brixton to frame her as a traitor. Meanwhile, on opposite sides of the globe, we meet our heroes, Luke Hobbs, Dwayne Johnson, in Los Angeles, and Deckard Shaw, Jason Statham, in London. Both are living their daily lives until they get wind of the virus situation through their respective sources. After intense nightclub interrogations, they learn about the terrorist group Edeon, the masterminds behind the virus. Hobbs, convinced by his old friend and CIA agent Locke, Ryan Reynolds, agrees to help. Shaw, after visiting his mother Queenie, Helen Mirren, in prison, reluctantly joins the mission too. The two are roped into working together, much to their chagrin. After being recruited by Agent Loeb, Rob Delaney, in a series of explosive encounters, Hobbs finds Hattie on the streets, and after a fierce struggle, manages to bring her in. Shaw, upon learning Hattie is his sister, teams up with Hobbs, but not before Brixton crashes in, leading to an epic showdown where they barely escape. The trio then tracks down Professor Andrico, Eddie Marson, the creator of the Snowflake, who informs them that the virus can only be extracted through a facility in Ukraine. They head to Moscow with fake identities, where Hobbs hilariously almost gets detained with the name Mike Oxmall. In Moscow, they meet Shaw's old flame, Margarita, Isa Gonzalez, who arms them for a mission to storm an Edeon facility. There, they face off against Brixton once more, leading to a high-stakes battle where they manage to retrieve the extraction device only to have it destroyed in the chaos. With nowhere else to turn, Hobbs suggests they lay low in Samoa, his childhood home. Back in Samoa, Hobbs reconnects with his estranged family, who gear up for an imminent attack from Brixton and Edeon's forces. Using their wits and bare hands, the Hobbs family fights off the goons in an epic showdown. In a climactic battle, Hobbs and Shaw team up to take down Brixton, who is eventually deprogrammed and defeated. In the aftermath, Shaw and Hattie visit their mother in prison, hinting at a possible escape plan. Hobbs, on the other hand, brings his daughter Sam to Samoa, deciding to stay and rebuild his relationship with his family. Stick around for the credits, where we get a glimpse of more adventures with Hobbs and Locke, and a hilarious payback prank on Shaw involving the police and a fake name. And that's a wrap on Hobbs and Shaw. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more exciting movie recaps.